Well, that's why to raise brand awareness, have a great product that people love and talk about. So it, it sort of spreads through word of mouth or, or some virality uh, to it. The other way is to get people associated with a company that also already have credibility and can create more momentum and visibility than you could on your own. That's, that's a model that was first popularized in the entertainment business, that if you have a script for a movie and you get Steven Spielberg to say, I want to be the executive producer, guess what? Suddenly a lot of people are willing to get involved in, in that movie. So the people that you are that are part of your network that you, you bring to either within the company or around the company also help you kind of break through the, the clutter. Because the battle now for startups is sort of good news, bad news. The good news is it's easier and cheaper to start a company. The bad news is as a result, more people do it and it's more cluttered. And so it's now a battle for attention. How do you break through that, that clutter? And ultimately it's gotta be driven by the product and why it is special and magical. Uh, but what you do to, to get people around your company that really give it more visibility and momentum is also critically important.